this one. Yeah. This time, yeah. match log of m. Yeah. We change the log base. Yeah. Actually, it's not a big change. Still log function, just base. Here we use use natural log base e, base e. Yeah. I hope you know that e constant, right? Natural log base e constant. Something like infinite many digits. Yeah. So it is an irrational number. E. Okay. Yeah, this E. Yeah. This E, yeah, actually in calculus. How to get that E? N goes to infinity. One plus one over M to nth power. This limit is E. That limit is E. Okay, so the E number is this one. Okay, just the background. Yeah. All right, so natural log of n belongs to little of n to the dth power. And what is this d? Here, I need to give you what is this d? All right, yeah. So here, this d, I have to erase. This d is greater than zero. Here, I do not say integer. This D, if it is a positive number greater than zero, then this result is correct. This result is correct. Yeah. All right. So let me show this result first. Yeah. Lobidas rule. Here, we can still use Lobidas rule. Yeah. All right. And we write a continuous version natural log of x over x to the d power okay because it is infinity over infinity in determinate form so we can apply the lobidas rule okay yeah now let's take derivative of the numerator one over x yeah. one over x Denominator derivative apply the power rule d times x to the d minus one power. Yeah. Two formulas. Yeah. After that, then we need to simplify. After simplification, we get this expression. So it is not a determinant form. One over d times x to the d power see yeah yeah so one constant this d constant but x to the d this part remember this d positive x to the d power d is a positive number and when x goes to infinity x to the d power also goes to infinity Denominator goes to infinity, the numerator constant, so the answer is zero. If the answer is zero, then we have that little note. Yeah. Here, I do not write that discrete variable version of the limit. So, yeah, we have that, yeah, but we make our conclusion. Natural log of n belongs to big O of n to the d this d we only need it's a positive number that's enough if d is a positive number we have this result okay all right so now another homework question similar to our first one i make the comment comment for another homework question yeah because here the requirement is d greater than zero that's enough. We have this result. Now, how about this time I select a D equal 0 0.000, many zeros at one. Okay? Very small, but it's positive. No problem, it's positive. Okay? Now I ask you to compare. One natural log of n 
and another one n to the 0 0.0000001 which one grows faster eventually yeah. right if you use the intuition you need to be careful and we have our result here right your intuition one side another side our result okay these two homework questions you need to be very careful. These two. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So we finish this module completely.